Eshu is deceptive because people have him as a child. People have him as, you know, being small. And that could cause a big misconception because Eshu is really the most important deity in the whole religion. Um, I would say even more important than Orula because without Eshu, Orula can't do anything. And, and Eshu is literally on par with God. So when we look at the human head, the front represents Olodumare, or Ori. But the back, this concept is born in the Odio Beate, represents Eshu. So this part has been scientifically proven to not be able to work unless this part is in balance. So it speaks of how Eshu and God, the light and the darkness, had to always be in balance, right?